I had been flying to San Francisco monthly to pick up my son Eric for our weekends together. It seemed natural that I would invite my new lady friend Shampoo to join me on my next trip, and voila, membership in the Mile High Club. I'm really excited to meet your son. Yeah. I really like kids. Mm. Hey, look, uh, now that we are one mile <laughs> up in the air, do you want to, uh... <laughs> what? Let's go have sex in the bathroom. I'm not gonna have sex in the bathroom. What? It's gross. What's gross about it? people in there. Oh, come on. This is a short flight. I don't think anybody is pooping on the way up to San Francisco. Come on. Is that why you invited me? Well... Because I'm a stripper. So I'd be up for that. Right? Uh, no. Gross. Everybody on this plane likes to have sex. You know what? If it was all about sex for me, yeah. I would have found somebody a lot hotter. That is one of the rudest things that anyone has ever said. <gasps> I thought you were different. I thought maybe for once I met a nice guy. I'm going to give you some space. Rather than turned on by the idea of sex in an airplane bathroom, Shampoo, a professional clothes remover, seemed stung. My trip to the Mile High Club with her was, as they say in the travel business, canceled. I would need to find someone on this flight more sexually adventurous than a stripper. And just when all seemed lost. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, excuse me. Sorry. Sorry about you. Wonder, can I switch seats with you by any chance? What? I'm, I'm in 23D. It's just right up there. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's great. It's just, it is a middle seat. After pouring out every ounce of available charm onto this woman, Beth, I was clearly, incredibly enough, being considered for admission into the club. Yes, exactly. You can go into space without being an astronaut. We have begun our initial descent to San Francisco International Airport. Please return to your seat and make sure you're are securely fastened. Uh, hey, Beth. This is gonna sound crazy. Yeah. I wanna have sex with you right now. <laughs> right now? Yeah, right now. Let's just follow this moment. Don't you feel it? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do, I do it. <laughs> okay, so will you sneak to the bathroom with me right now and have sex? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> just see Yeah. So. Let me get to the airport. Take the cab to the closest hotel. No. Listen, I can't wait that long. Okay, we'll find a place in the airport. No, I, I can't wait that long either. No, seriously. No, it's super dangerous. I, no, it's it's not that dangerous. Beth could obviously disregard many of society's guidelines for how to behave, but not for some reason, the seatbelt sign. I don't want to do it in an airport okay, bathroom. Not safe to I want to do it in an airplane bathroom. Seriously. Yeah, but the seatbelt sign is on. Who cares about the seatbelt sign? Seriously. And let's go to a nice hotel. No, thank you. Oh my God. Oh, hey, what about another flight? No, don't touch me. Okay. 